How's it going today, guys? Well, so apparently we've gotten a couple of uh, votes in and people want to see a little bit of gun stuff, which, hey, I can understand that's what this channel started about. So, but today I do have a gun video today. It's just going to be a short little one. I'm going to show you guys a little hack that I did a while back. I, I, I posted about it before, but not really so much of uh, what the product is and how I came about it. But uh, so in today's video, I actually want to show you guys a little vehicle hack so that way you can conceal carry in your vehicle and mount your gun somewhere where you can actually have it in a readily accessible spot in your vehicle without having to drill any holes. It's just a short, small, simple little life hack for your newer vehicles that you don't want to put holes in your uh, dash in order to uh, conceal carry in your vehicle. Um, this is for not being on your person. This is specifically for whenever you're in your car and say you have two guns, one that's on your person and one for your vehicle. Um, this one specifically is for in your vehicle. This is not for on your person. Uh, so in this video, I have a belly band. This one is by Comfort Tack. I think I got it on Amazon for like maybe 10 or 15 bucks. And this was, I don't know, about four years ago I got this belly band. And I literally bought the belly band specifically for my car. Um, and I'm telling you, it is a super easy life hack. Literally, you take the belly band and you wrap it around the steering column of your vehicle so that that way you don't have to put any holes in your dash to like to mount a magnet or a holster to your vehicle. This is a simple life hack as in not doing any of that. So literally, you're just gonna be wrapping this around the steering column and it's gonna be super easy. I'll show you right now. I don't have one in there for my gun. So right now, we'll go ahead and take the belly band. Like I said, this is just as, uh, trying to be as simple as possible without actually putting hole, holes in the dash or anything like that. This is just to kind of save you some time, save you some labor in mounting a gun magnet or something like that, you know. Those are nice, but is it really nice to put a hole in your dash? Well, not to me. So anyways, what I do is I take the belly band and I literally put it underneath the column and I wrap it around. And I'm telling you, this is like got to be the easiest life hack that you could do and, and still have your gun readily accessible. So as you wrap it around, now you take your gun. Yes, it is clear. Okay. And whenever I'm driving, I put it in this way. So you just slide it in, lock it in place. So that way it doesn't come out. And voila, just like that. Super simple, completely easy. And I believe the belly band was only like 10, 15 bucks. And I'm telling you, watch how fast it is. When you're out on the road, I'm telling you, it is so much easier to have something be readily accessible and hole free on your vehicle. But on this specific model, I have something a little bit different. So I'm not really using the whole belly band in this specific vehicle because well, on the Rams, they kind of have a little bar here, or a little pocket, not bar, a pocket. And I'm telling you, your holster fits in there relatively tight. And uh, here, let me see if I can do this. My gun just drops right in and comes right out. I mean, like I said, it's gonna save you a ton of time and trying to mount your gun to your vehicle and as you can tell i don't want to put any holes in in this 2022 so for a simple little life hack say you know you didn't have this specific model vehicle so you didn't have that little cubby like i do but i'm telling you it's going to save you a lot of time and effort and also keeping your vehicle hole free so i mean i i know i don't like putting holes in a brand new vehicle so if you guys like this idea, um, like I said, super simple. And uh, yeah, 
I appreciate you guys' time. I, I appreciate you guys' feedback with uh, the polls we were running. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here because it is about to rain. And I will see you guys in the next video. And uh, like I said, hopefully it's something kind of like this or another teardown video because I do have many more guns to show you guys. And I would love to do another teardown video with, uh, hopefully my next gun will be the, um, I believe the next gun that I was wanting to do is the uh, SIG uh, MPX. So if you guys are wanting to see that video, leave a comment down below and hopefully we can do that one within the next week or so. Um, because I am a little scheduled up this week, so hopefully that gun video will be a, a, a good video to do next. Um, it's not going to be a complete teardown, but I will put that, uh, I'll put that gun in the video. So uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.